The strike from the sky no one saw coming. I thought that maybe there was an explosion or a plane crash. And the cosmic coincidence as a separate massive asteroid brushes by. An empty spot in Harper's cabinet. I give uh, M Mr. Duncan uh, credit for actually doing the right thing. Stepping down of the letter that sealed the fate of the Aboriginal Affairs Minister. And the driving force behind a growing online phenomenon. We're almost up to 76 million viewers. One man's hobby becomes his economic engine. CTV National News with Lisa Leflam. Reporting tonight, Sandy Ronaldo. We leave you tonight with a look at the world in miniature, but make no mistake, there's nothing dainty about it. It's rugged and always ready to roll. It began as one man's hobby, just having a little fun with remote-controlled cars and trucks, and then he revved it into a big business where the toys take on a life of their own. We'll let CTV's Janet Dirks grab the wheel now and steer us into this next report. It looks so lifelike, a truck spinning its wheels in the mud. But this is a radio-controlled truck in a video created by Calgarian Aaron Vodochka. And we'll shoot a story. There's an actual plot line to what we're doing here. This is one of hundreds of videos Vodochka creates for YouTube in a series called RC Adventures. We're almost up to 76 million viewers and 100,000 subscribers from around the world custom job we have. The 35-year-old former disc jockey models and customizes the vehicles, comes up with the storylines, and shoots and edits everything himself. I wanted to figure out a way to activate the imagination. And he seems to have sparked a flame. This is catching on like wildfire. Everybody used to have a radio control hobby products when they were young, and a lot of folks don't realize how far technology has come. Badochka's hobby has become his business. He earns his living from this, thanks to the advertising on YouTube. Very fortunate. At this hobby shop, there's a buzz around Badochka's videos. Yeah, we've had come in and tell me that they got into it because they saw a video just going through YouTube stuff. It's something they can go out and do themselves. Badochka says his demographic is 13 to 85 years old and mostly male, but he wanted to get his wife Jem involved. Pinky is this particular one. So. He surprised her with a truck in her favorite color. He really tailored it and customized it, so it was all about me. Now Jem participates in some of the videos. We did a little spin. Aaron Badochka figures he has years left in this career. He's having too much fun. And besides, there are too many trails left for his trucks to travel on. Janet Dirks, CTV News, Calgary. That's our newscast for this Friday. Thank you for being with us. I'm Sandy Ronaldo for all of us here at CTV National News. Have a good night and a good week ahead. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Your news. See it. Live it. And get what you want. Experience your news, your way, on CTV News Channel.